Happy New Year. We hope your break went great. And now that we're back, we have a lot of things to look forward to, like the class of 2024 graduating in six months. Don't forget, spring will be here in just under three months. The CFF is just under a month away, which we're hoping won't be hijacked by former video students. Don't give Ripley any ideas. Oh, the semester ends three weeks from tomorrow with Winter Pep and Spirit Week before it. And basketball has their Midnight Madness event tomorrow. But you know what I'm looking forward to more this year? Oh, I know this. The rest of the news. Yep. Everyone got the text and a call from the school yesterday from the district about the South Lot. To break things down, the South Lot is for buses only after school. Starting Monday, no one will be allowed to be picked up or dropped off in the South Lot. If you try, you will be turned away. Also, buses leave at 2.07. Many people are getting to their buses late. Holding up your bus delays it for over 100 other students across the district. If you take a bus, make sure to get to it on time. On the topic of buses, if you need to ride a different bus, you must turn in a signed bus pass before school. To find out more, check in with the main office. Over break, our basketball teams had some action. Varsity boys beat Bonnie Lake, but couldn't hold back Bremerton. They are now 4-4 four and four for the year. The girls are 4-7. and seven. Wrestling was at the Gut Check Tournament over the break, one of the toughest national tournaments in the Northwest. Dylan Sternod had an impressive two days, placing fourth as a freshman. Our Lady Wolves were also there with Rosemary Brooks placing third. Keep your calendar clear for next Thursday. It will be wrestling senior night. They'll face Bethel, so make sure to pack the gym. Our basketball teams have a crazy show for you tomorrow. Good evening, basketball fans. Yeah. JD. Let's go. Your South Kitsap Wolves. We have a one night show that's just for you. SK Wolves doing just what they do. See them on the court, you see y'all in the stands. Midnight Madness is your Friday plan. SK Ballers going for them alley you See y'all swigging in the paint, he gon' work the hoop. Miller in from half court, he do all them sorts. Avoiding this one event should be a last resort. Ready putting up them. Beam. On the other side, the steals come from Haggard. Poison 10 knocking down all them buzzer beaters. She jaw dropping folks and men they can't believe it. See dance, get in on the act. Don't just sit back, just be there where it's at. Seven bones in the den, we'll just get you in. Come and take your seat and let the fun begin. Besides a dunk and three-point contest, they will have a musical chair event at the half with fans from the stands. If you haven't gotten your tickets yet, get them from the ASB office. Moving from winter to spring sports, boys soccer will be having an inf informational meeting Wednesday after school in Coach Conley's room. That's room 230. Seniors, if your parents want to put a special page for you into the yearbook, the deadline is January 19th. Make sure to let them know so they don't miss out. Don't lose your memories. If you haven't bought a yearbook yet, they are on sale now for $65 at the ASB office on a first-come, first-sold basis. Once we run out, there won't be any more. Before break, the freshman ASB gained seven new senators. They are Benjamin Niffert, Brandon Grand Mason Landers, Elena Lesterdame, Aaron Trent, Nico Berry, Sergio Mier, and Ashlyn Sergit. That makes 14 total representatives for the freshman class. Good luck to you and the whole class of 2027. In Career Center news, the PSNS Work Study Program info session is scheduled for next Friday. Juniors can apply to work full time at Puget Sound Naval Shipyard and experience several different trades and shops. Sign up in the Career Center to attend the meeting and learn more. In club news, DECA members, please turn in your permission slip for Area 7 DECA to Miss Fighter by Monday. The club's meeting today are 3D WIT, ASL, Art, PIPA, Ceramics, DECA, FCCLA, German, Japanese, K-pop, Psychology, Spanish, and Speech and Debate. The meeting tomorrow will be Advocates of Human Rights and Pickleball in the morning. Over break, did you see the Huskies play? You dub on top. I can't wait to watch them at the championships against the Wolverines next week. Me either. Well. I think it's safe to say we can end the show today. Agreed. I've been Thomas. And I've been Kayla. And that's, and that's the, the way, way the wolf, wolf howls. howls.